White hats, woo! Black hats, mm-hmm. Who's winning? Oh, what does this even mean? I didn't know what it meant, because I don't watch the stuff out there. I'm not gonna use a nasty name about what it is. Yeah, conspiracies. Who's winning the battle for the final conclusion of planet Earth? Oh, we're gonna go into that, yes. I'm gonna tell you exactly what's going on, and I want you to get a grip on this because, as I shared with you, there are things going on, little secret societies that have been going on. They're now popping up because it's time. We're past the tipping point. We're going into something really new, but here's what's so important for you to pay attention to. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna explain that in a moment. Let's go. Andrea Anka on YouTube here to help you break through fears and live an amazing life. Why do I say this? My whole platform I realized when we break through fear we accept that it exists. It does serve us well. Fear is fun. You know, you go to scary movies, it's fun. You go out and jump out of a plane, ooh, it's fun. Then there's the fear that's not so much fun. The one that wakes you up at 3 o'clock in the morning and tells you you're never going to, you know, be loved again. <laughs> And, and there's the one, there's the fear that tells you not to walk in the lion's den. Fear is not a problem. It's a distortion we've created, all right? You can create a castle just as easy as a button. These things you shall do and more. Ye are all gods. My gosh, how many times do we have to hear this over and over? Like, Ye are all gods. In other words, we're all on the level of creating our realities. Please tell YouTube that you want more positive, powerful videos because we're going to talk about that today. I like my neutral hat best of all. <sighs> White, white hats and black hats, what's new, right? Cowboys and Indians, we have been battling one another and in separation for as long as humans have existed. This is just another uh, excuse and form because people are fascinated with conflict. That's really all it is. And the reason we came here is to experience all the forms of what we can be on a lower density. All right, We're on a lower density planet. We agreed to lose consciousness of what we are because if we knew what we were, we wouldn't be doing cray cray stuff out there, right? There would be no sides to take. We want to experience what that is. All right. So when you are in the ocean, you guys are deep divers. I have a, I have a, I'm a certified, advanced certified diver. Uh, you know, you do one of those deep dives. The sun is obliterated. Those rays can't go down as low. So the spectrum changes, and and you lose color down there. It's like a deep, deep blue, and everything's very slow. Well, those little creatures on that level have no clue that those other colors exist. They don't know what's at the top and frankly don't have any interest because their world is right down here and that's all they know and we're in that world and I want to share with you what's going on. There will be battles and factions and things going on at all times. They always are, they always will and it's going to play out. We don't go into a new earth here where there's no conflict anymore because that's not what we signed up. The Matrix was designed to be able to choose those negative uh, actions, thoughts, beliefs. We were, we're allowed to choose that, and so that's part of the playing field. If that goes away, then we'll just go off to another planet where you know, there's no conflict at all. We've been in, at, in those before. We came here to, to, to know what we're gonna choose in conflict, all right? What are you going to choose in conflict? The meek shall inherit the earth. I just did this video, if you didn't see it, uh, and I talk about uh, the secret societies and investments. Now, I'm a former investment banker. And so I know for a fact that there are people out there that have shared stuff with me that don't talk publicly about what they're thinking and they are going into a space of, I'll, I'll, I'll use the word spirituality, but uh, let's just say oneness. White hats and black hats, if, you, if you're choosing a white hat, you're in separation. Yeah, you're in separation. There's no difference. 
you're just choosing a different separation that's not as painful and it's 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 not oneness it can't be if it was oneness you wouldn't look at this as a problem right true oneness you don't you don't go into separation of anybody all right that means the lowest this you do through the least of us you do to me that means they are equally absolutely powerful and unconditionally loved because the one doesn't judge it is the creator is the creation and is the power behind it which is you not you we always think well me me that no not you the person you look at in the mirror you the energy field that is animating that that's animating everything that is not separated between you and I so here's I want to make this so clear because here's what's going to happen these Lighter beings are playing things out in high-powered positions, in governments, institutions, corporations. They're everywhere, and they have money. This is why, you know, I go after abundance, this broke, you know, uh, we, we shouldn't want money. It's, it's a load of doo-doo. <laughs> you know what today is? You're getting a spiritual butt kick, yeah. May I have another, please? Sorry, Visa. Uh, so what I want to share with you is, if you guys have signed up, I've got something really cool for you. I'm teaching people to shift. My whole platform is teaching you, and we're going to do this today, teaching you how to shift into the reality that you want. Because it's a choice. It's a total choice. And that's what the matrix is. What's the choice I'm going to make? Everything's about your choice. Everything plays out because those are your best teachers. Those people that bug you are consciously set up in the intelligent field, in our unconscious state, that's an illusion, so that you could make a higher choice. It's always available to you. And that's what's going on. When you pick a white hat or a black hat, you're still in separation. And so it's just talk to the hand. You know, I always say, you know, Charlie Brown, wah, wah, wah. The subject matter is irrelevant. Your frequency is everything. What's your frequency? Oneness, unconditional love, no judgment is the highest frequency. All right? That means that that jackass out there who's doing horrible things doesn't mean you have to tolerate that. We're going to step in. Because the meek do inherit the earth. There are ways that they counterbalance that, not by conflict, but by finding solutions. Why is that happening? Because that person is in fear. And when you send them compassion, you realize, wait a second, they're not doing it because they're evil, rotten people, because they are equal, perfect, you know, unconditional light beings playing that out. They're going into fear. They're going into anger. And they're not striking out because they hate this. They're striking out because they feel the hate and the lack of love here this is this is what's striking out all right so it's I always say it's never personal it's never personal when somebody's nasty it's not just you they're doing it to everybody right unless they have an agenda and so that's a low frequency so we want to send them light and love everybody so you walk you can walk away you don't have to hang out with it but I want you to know we're all equal beings there is no battle to win. There is no battle amongst the higher beings. Higher beings don't battle. They create the new earth. They're creators. They're expansive. They go into this space. This is oneness and this is awakening is when you go outside of your body, you're more focused. You're, you're always outside of it. You're, you're, you're the expansive space. All right, that higher self is you. It's never disconnected. Nothing's ever disconnected. So when you focus on that, when I focus on that, that wave, probability becomes a particle, so you get to choose your reality. I'm teaching you guys here. If you're in my list already, you get a free webinar, and we talk about how do you get out of this? How do you get out of this? You know, hanging on to, watching the negativity, believing conflict, believing all of it. Everybody has an opinion. Even spiritual teachers, some of them are speaking fear. That's separation. And I'm telling you right now, everybody's an equal, perfect light being playing out roles. That's it. Whatever you do, your choice determines your frequency, which determines your reality. Does this make sense? So when you come in here, I have a new course coming out. 
it's coming out. It's it's October now. It's coming out at the end of October, and it's called Five Steps to Shift into a New Reality. Shifting your mindset completely. How do we do that? You guys know this. If you haven't bought the book, fear is a, is an obstacle. It's a chosen one. It's nobody makes you fear or angry. Nobody makes you sad. You have to choose it. And how do you choose it? You're telling yourself a story. I'm telling myself a story. There are good people and bad people, white hats and black hats. We have, we label things. There's no labeling outside of the material world because we're one. We don't even have names out there. All those names we have for angels and all those things, that's just what humans need to define things. Out there, it doesn't exist. We're just one light being. Yeah, just one light energy exploring everything it can be. We're here in a very dense planet. This is an illusion, so I want you to know something right now. That new earth exists for you, and, and light beings, uh, let's just say light workers, everybody's a light worker if they choose it. They're not special, there's no chosen, I'm the chosen one. Oh, I was told I was chosen. Chosen for what? I mean, everybody has the choice to awaken and go back into their natural state and stop playing the illusion. It's just an illusion. Everyone has that opportunity. Everybody's special. You're, per you're perfect. All right, that's another form of separation, the chosen ones, the waves of volunteers. And by the way, that does exist. People did come here to help raise the frequency. But we, do, we to elevate those people and think that they're special and different, they're just playing a different role. The ones who have the battle of challenges going on in the illusion are really special because they took a lot on so that means they have a much further distance to go to to make higher choices your reality your new earth is is going to happen if you choose it it it's absolutely it's an individual choice because there are whole groups of people okay think about it if there is separation there's whole groups of people living in peace over here and people over here living in conflict right Realities are the same way. They just go beyond the material world to create the material world. In other words, if I choose uh, a higher frequency and love, I will actually see the world differently. And I'm connecting to those higher frequencies so the things that come into my life will be on that frequency. Okay, does that make sense? That's where your frequency counts. So you can go all live in a peaceful community, but if you're on a high frequency, all of a sudden everything's going to connect to you and materialize on that high frequency. And so there will be no white hat, black hat, you know, evil people we have to fight. It's just baloney, and you can get consumed with that. People love it. It's a game. Okay, if you need to do it, do it. There's no good nor bad. Again, you're going to choose what happens in your reality, and that means you're going to be in the frequency. You're going to be in the, in the uh, uh, dungeons, the basement, with the mold. It's dark and stinky. There's no light down there. You don't even know where the door is. Who's, who else is in there? It's a miserable place. Wouldn't you rather be in the penthouse? That's all it is. You're just choosing. So are we saying they're special and we're not? No, of course, because if we raise our frequency, we can go up there too. It's not like we're not allowed, right? Everybody's allowed. It's a choice. This white hat, black hat stuff, let it go. If you, you might be having fun. Maybe that's fun for you to create that garbage. You know what? It is garbage because our whole planet's loaded with garbage and we gotta start cleaning up our nest. Yeah, because it's negative and it's low frequency and it doesn't feel good. Now, so I want you to just ask yourself what choices you've been making. And who you've been watching and what what have you been exposing yourself to and if you're watching media because it's all programmed all of it 100 percent programmed it's controlled by money which some is not the positive stuff and that's okay so we do have people working to make big changes they are facilitators they're change makers they are not going to go into conflict and battle anybody. It's not like they're going to rise up and battle evil. That's just some made-up crap that I don't know where that even came from. Sounds fun, right? It's exciting. Not so much if you're involved in it, so you don't have to be. We're going into it. We're in it right now. I see huge changes. Positive, wonderful things are happening. And if you can stop looking at people as something separate and wrong... 
and know they're playing out the very thing that is allowing you to make higher choices, you'll be thankful and gratitude. You guys, did you, are you using C to G? If I have anything negative, it's a complaint. They're wrong. They shouldn't be doing that. You shouldn't be talking to me that way. You should be dressing like this. You shouldn't. Yeah, it's a complaint. Yeah, a C is a low frequency no matter what. It's judgment, complaint. It's a complaint that the world or a person or a situation isn't okay. The first thing you want to do is catch yourself and go into G, gratitude. If you come into my uh, series, the five steps to shift into a new reality takes you into total mindset, and we start with the very first thing, and what is that? If we don't break through the fear and recognize what it is, it will continue to control us, and that's separation. And when you master that, and I help you master that, boy, we go into a space where, wow, I can do anything. And your intentions are different because you are not living in fear anymore. So you don't look for the material world to make you happy, but you happen to get all those things because now all of a sudden you have no barriers or negative thoughts about it. Oh, I can't have it. I'm not good enough. You know, and then all of a sudden it's gone. It's like, what? all right, what? whatever. And all of a sudden things show up for you. This is how it works. Are you ready to do that? So now, um, get ready for five uh, steps to a new reality that's coming out. That is a, a mini course. Uh, the first thing you see is a beautiful free webinar uh, that takes you through the steps of what does it take to shift into that new earth and a peaceful place where there are no limits. What are the steps? And I, you know I love to simplify things for you. Again, I hope you'll subscribe. AI is only doing what we tell it to. And if we tell it we like garbage, and that's by click, click, click on the garbage, it says, oh, you love garbage. It doesn't judge. AI doesn't judge. Right? So I want you to think very hard about every choice that you make because there's no difference between this and this. I happen to like black. I wear a lot of black. It's a very cool non-color. Wait a minute, which one has no color, the black or the... Uh, uh, get ready because, like I said, we're taking everything up a notch. It's, we're going past right and wrong, and um, I know some of you struggle with that. That's okay. When you're ready, you accept that all things are equal and beautiful. And, uh, you know, again, the challenges mean I get to be the change maker. Tonight I am in a fashion show. I'm walking a beautiful little boy. If you're on my Instagram account, I will be shooting tonight on that account. I'm walking this little boy down the runway, and he, he's an aspiring writer. So these are kids who are aspiring to be something. Uh, one wants to be a doctor. This one happens to be a writer. So they teamed me up with him to walk down the runway. And uh, I'm going to encourage him to write those books. He's only 10 years old, and uh, he spent his entire life in illness. So the question is, why? Why did, why did these things happen? We cannot always know why certain energy fields choose challenges. Others choose to be involved in those challenges because we evolve through it. And I know it's unpleasant but this is so temporary. It's not who you are. No one actually dies. If you can just remember that, we just have to be our best in those challenges and go into oneness. Can you do that? Of course you can. Guys, these are free videos. Wait do you see what's coming out. The Creation Station's coming out, Digital Explorers, my new course. That's coming out November 1st of 2023. This can be old real quick. If you click here, you'll get the opportunity to see the numerous ways that I help people to earn online doing good things. It is a wonderful feeling. You're whole and perfect, strong and powerful, loving, harmonious and happy. Blessings to you, my friend. Namaste.